Hi viewers, welcome to Penos Totten. In this video, we are going to see a short review on Gamma Double End Hand Light Brown Pattern Acrylic Made and Ebonate uh, Fountain Pen. And here, this is a double ended uh, cap, and here, this is a body, and this is a transparent glass uh, um, flat doomed surface uh, cap uh, end on the both sides. And these both are the caps and you can easily remove this this is a thread mechanism and this is a both uh, nibs and these both are number 35 nibs with fine tip and if you want to fill the ink for this uh, this side's uh, nib pen you can unscrew this part and please apply silicone grease or vaseline whenever you are opening and closing this area for the ink fill this will give a long run to your fountain pen and here we can fill this portion and this will can hold a 3 ml of inks and here these are the long threads which are so strong so the, no leakage problem will occur, occur in this pen and here this portion also you can fill uh, the ink this can also uh, will store 3 ml of inks more than 3 ml of inks and yeah uh, now for the diameter the holding area's diameter is 11, 11 mm and the body's diameter is 15.6 mm same to this side and the brand's name gamma was uh, stamped here and now the writing for today's writing I'm going to use pen of violet color ink very fine writing extremely smooth Yeah, the writing is extremely awesome and these are some uh, these are a fancy pens and some pen collectors uh, may love this pen and these are some specific uh, uh, rare uh, collections uh, for in this mo uh, some models This is a quite lengthy pen when you are using this and this cannot be separated and you can swap this nib as you like since we have number 35 nibs in many brands and many uh, many tips like fine medium broad and again with gold dual tone and with silver or with flex nibs also you can sw there is two nibs uh, same nibs were here so you can swap the nibs as you like and The total weight of this pen is this is 42 grams and the most important thing in all pens is uh, all fountain pens especially is uh, maintenance please wash the pens regularly that is twice a month because all the dye based ink will precipitate on longer usage so it will block the ink's passage in the feeder so you will get a scratchy writing or uh, slowly the ink will dry quickly then you may have to shake the pens for the ink flow to come out 
so for that you can uh, the reason is the blockage in the feeder screw so uh, you can remove this uh, feeder uh, feeder unit uh, separately by holding this and twisting this out and you can wash this in the uh, soap water or in running tap water and you can brush the feeder and clean it well with the uh, water and in some ink bottles itself you can notice on every fill it is recommended to clean the pen with water so it is clear unless otherwise we have good cleaning and maintenance the flow will be affected and for gamma pens it is little uh, little hard to remove the nibs and feeder to uh, remove and you can fix this and the both are a quite a difficult uh, thing so we are having some uh, uh, yeah one machine for that it is ultrasonic machine so we can easily remove this and uh, if, we, if it is so stick uh, stuck with uh, um, with the ink flow we can easily uh, do services for your pen and for just removing we can uh, we are having those tools for that and it is quite an easy job for us so if you are having those problems you can uh, even send us those pens and we will do services and we will send it back and yeah if you have any query about this pen you can ask in the comment section or else you can make a call to our mobile number thanks for watching this video thank you